welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be a what's in my diaper bag video. Um, I'm actually pretty excited to do this because I got a new diaper bag and I love it. So let me just say first of all, the bag that I'm going to talk about today did, it was not sent to me. This is not sponsored. I paid for this bag with my own monies and uh, yeah, I really, really love it and I'm going to tell you all the reasons why I love it and show you kind of the inside and everything because I think this is a great bag. Um, I also want to share with you guys, I know this is kind of random, but at this top, I found a lot of times I get asked in the comments about jewelry or things I'm wearing, so I'm going to start linking those things below in the description box. But this top in particular, these kind of bell sleeves are very trendy right now, uh, but I really, really like this top. It comes in a ton of different colors and it's from Amazon. Just now, like tiptoeing into the brave new world of buying clothes on Amazon. Um, so anyways, I got this in two colors and I really, really like it. So I will leave it linked down below. Um, I'm planning to also do a blog post that will accompany this video. So that will be down below in the description box as well. And you'll be able to see some better pictures of the top and cause it's really great like postpartum top. It's very uh, forgiving and it is just long enough. I'm 5'8 and it's just long enough to cover my bum um, so that I can wear it with leggings. So it's a great, just, you know, easy throw on thing. And especially it's like light and cool and great for fall when you live in the South and it's still 85 degrees. I feel like I wanna be in the fall spirit, but I can't be wearing sweaters and stuff. So this is a good, um, just kind of fall top for where I live, especially. Let's get in and talk about this bag. Okay, now let me just preface this. I realize that this particular color pattern is not for everybody but the bag itself is awesome. So don't shut it down in your mind just because you're not a fan of the print or color because it does come in different color options. Um, I think like black, there's a beautiful maroon color which I really waffled between, but this is the bag. Ah! It's by a company called 12 Little and uh, as you can see, it is a cheetah print messenger style bag. It does have handles here and then it has a big long handle here. Just a couple of things quickly. This bag is made out of like a nylon type feeling material and it's quilted. So think of like a down jacket or a puffy jacket. That's what this kind of feels like. Very wipeable, very easy to keep clean. Um, the main reason, okay, obviously, I mean, I love the cheetah print and everything. It's so fun, um, especially for fall and winter. I just, I love it. And I really went back and forth like, do I have the gonads to carry a giant cheetah diaper bag? And I was like, yes, I do. I certainly do. Um, <laughs> so anyways, I just think it's so cute. Part of the reason that I really wanted a light bag, and some of you might be thinking, Angie, I thought you got that fun design bag. You had it in your baby gear haul and that bag did not end up working out for me. And I'm gonna explain why in a separate video that's coming up. And once again, that bag was purchased with my own money as well. So what I really wanted was a bag that the bag itself was light. Um, I also have a Lily Jade bag and I love that bag. I think it's a beautiful bag. It's just that even empty, it's kind of heavy. So by the time I put in stuff for two babies, forget about it. The bag is ridiculously heavy. So that's the problem that I've been running into uh, a lot with different diaper bag choices. 12 Little does make backpack option bags. I will be honest with you. As much as everybody's like, I love a backpack because then your hands free. I don't love a backpack because it's just a pit. It's just a pit. Everything just gets stuffed down. There's not great ways to organize things within the bag. And so everything, I mean, we were constantly digging for things. And if I sent my husband into the bag for something, forget about it. He was like, I can't find anything, throwing things around. So backpack style bags actually don't work well for me. Let's just jump in to what I have inside of my bag. And then, like I said, I'll show you guys up close some more details of the bag and stuff. Inside one of the pockets in the inside, I keep wipes and a bunch of diapers. Uh, now this is just a little Huggies pack that I have, but I do like the ones I normally carry the ones that are refillable, like the Huggies thing that is refillable. So Huggies wipes are like my favorite wipes. So Huggies wipes and I've got some Pampers diapers in here and I do carry usually somewhere between four to six diapers um, for the girls. 
and then it also has and I've just got this stuck in there as well the little changing pad thing have my nursing cover and again I will link to any of the stuff I've gotten some questions about this too I will link to all this stuff in the description box below but this is by copper pearl and it is by far my favorite nursing cover I've ever used um, in my three times that I've nursed babies it has a decent size opening here but it's nice and long and covers a lot so it's really easy for me to get a baby under there and kind of scoop it around them and then be able to bumble around with these giant knockers to get them <laughs> out and fed um, I used I borrowed my sister's milk snob one and it was too small like I had a hard time getting the baby latched without feeling like I was gonna flash somebody it's like a nice it's thick as in like you can't see through it it's not so thick that it's miserable uh, but yeah I've breastfed in public with this many a time and I'm quite comfortable doing so some people don't like to use covers you do your thing chicken wing I just prefer to cover I also have inside of here one of the copper pearl burp rags love these burp rags my lighting is a little funky so you can't see it but it's like this kind of peach uh, maybe like herringbone type print it's really pretty love these they're nice and big you can toss it over your shoulder burp a baby and if they puke it you know what I'm talking about they puke and it like bleh, goes down your back this takes care of that good size I also carry one of these which is a I believe they're called like tea cloths they're from Target it's just a plain white uh, I think they're in like the dish section. These make really great burp rags. You get a big pack of them. I cannot remember how much it costs. Not expensive, very inexpensive. They wash up, great. Yeah, it's great. It's a great burp rag. So I carry another one of those. And then I also have a bib in here. We don't, the girls are so tiny. We don't really use bibs a ton, but I do have one in here in case I want to use it. Now, I carry a spare set of clothes for the girls and I'm actually on the hunt for, I want some of those like little wet bags because I think it's good to kind of separate things. And um, I may look, I think that company Itsy Ritzy makes some really cute little wet bags. So I wanna get one of those to put their spare clothes into and zip it up. So for right now, I just have a onesie and a little outfit and a pair of socks. These are just spare things I carry in case someone has a blowout, but eventually those will go inside, like I said, some kind of separate bag. Um, and then I just drop my wallet down in there as well. And I also carry my own little like makeup toiletries type bag. This, you know, it's kind of out of necessity in the postpartum period because I need pads and things like that. But now I've just gotten into the habit of it and I really like it. And in here, because I'm a breastfeeding mama, so I get hungry. Um, I have two different RX bars and a Lara bar, pumpkin pie. So I've got some snacks in there for myself. I've also just got like a little thing of dry shampoo some hand lotion, um, some bobby pins, a lip liner and lipstick, one of these feminine hygiene wipes, which, you know, you can use down there if you need to, but you can also just use it to like, if the baby spits up and it goes down in between my boobs, I want a wet wipe to like clean, <laughs> clean. You guys know what I'm saying. I also usually carry nursing pads in here. I don't have any in the mo at the moment, but they're usually in there. And then I have some of my Smith's Minted Rose Lip Balm, which I love. So that's kind of like my little mama bag that goes down inside of there for my stuff. Inside in the zipper pocket, I have hashtag real life, a diaper wrapped in a diaper bag. This was from <laughs> the dance studio yesterday. I forgot to take it out of there. But I have the little, the little tiny diaper trash bags that you can wrap up a stinky diaper in. I've got those. A little nose bulby syringe thing. We have the nose Frida that stays at home because that's where I use it the most. Um, so this is just where I carry something. I've got two little headbands in here. These are from Modern Piggy. I've also got this, uh, it's just a Vaseline um, like diaper cream. They gave this to me at the hospital and I just stuck it in here. Um, should I need to put diaper ash cream on them on the go? And I also actually have this little tiny bottle of Soothe Probiotic Colic Drops. These things are pretty good. They're also very expensive. Like, holy cow, this tiny little bottle is like 30 bucks. Um, crazy. So that's everything that I have inside the little zipper pocket. And then in the outside pockets right now, I just keep my keys and my phone. Very easily accessible. And I keep a little thing of Honest Company hand sanitizer so that I can sanitize myself and the children the moment that I see them, pick them up from school, leave a store, you know, that kind of thing. 
And then on the side pouch over here, I have my sunglasses. And then in the other side pouch, I usually keep a bottled water. The only things that I don't have in here right now are actually, I usually carry two bottles and the little sorter thing for formula. Um, we have started supplementing the girls with formula. I unfortunately am just not making enough milk, and so we've had to start supplementing with formula, which is totally fine. Um, I'll talk about that in another video, probably in the baby's two month update video, I'll talk about adding in formula as a supplement. So normally I have that in here as well. Um, I just don't because we used it and I took the bottles out to clean them. I feel like it's a a good amount of stuff. I said it all fits really well and the bag does not get heavy, heavy, which is great. Even with the formula, the bottles, like I mean, and bottled water and stuff, it just, it doesn't get super heavy and I love that. So aside from the bag just being totally my style and uber, uber cute in my opinion, um, I just love it. Okay, so as you guys can see, this is what the bag looks like. In the front, you've got these little handles here, which are so nice to just throw over your shoulder. You've also got this black strap here uh, that you can wear it more like a messenger style bag. You've got the wide pocket in the front. And like I said, this is where I keep, I just drop my cell phone down in there, my keys, and a sanitizer. So all that stuff is very easily accessible, but it's nice and deep, so I don't feel like anything's gonna fall out of there. Um, I've got this side pocket over here, and that's where I keep my sunglasses. And then this side pocket over here is where I keep my bottled water, either for myself or for mixing up a formula bottle if I need to. And then you can see it zips at the top right here. So you can unzip it, like so. And see how it's kind of, like I said, got this like boning material here that's a little bit bendy. So you can kind of still keep it closed or you can really get in there and get it open. So as you can see, there's still some sense of organization in here. It's not totally just like a pit, like I feel like some of the um, the more backpack style bags are. This is where I have my wipes and diapers. This is a little changing pad cover. I've got my wallet down over here, my little mama bag. Inside this pocket is where the burp rag is, my nursing cover, and then these two burp rags are right here, and then, on this side is where you have this inside pocket that you can open. And like I said, that's where I just have like some stuff tossed down in there. Um, hair bows, bulb syringe, trash baggies for dirty diapers, stuff like that. So there's lots of organization possible. Normally I would have, um, like I said, I would normally have like two bottles stuck down in here as well. And the little spinny canister for the already divided out formula would be kind of down in there as well. Um, and then this usually just kind of lives somewhere on top of that stuff. So it's really easy. And then if I need to get to my wallet, I just open it up while it's right there, drop it back down in. It's not easily snatchable by somebody. So it's a very light bag. Like I said, you also have this kind of like hidden compartment down here. It'd also be a really good place to store diapers and wipes if you wanted to. Um, I would put something flat down in here, not anything that's round because obviously that's the bottom of the bag. So I'd put something flat down in there. So maybe some more diapers and wipes or this would even be a good place I could move their change of clothes to down here. So they're not in the way because that's not something I'm going to use every time I go out, likely. Hopefully not. We have that many poo explosions. It's probably time to change diaper sizes. So yeah, this is the bag. I absolutely love it. That is everything I have in my diaper bag. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Be sure to subscribe to my channel if you're new and you're not already subscribed. But yeah, let me know down in the comments below what your favorite kind of diaper bag is to carry. If you like carrying backpack style bags or if you like carrying messenger style bags or what you like. Let me know down below in the comments and I will see you guys again really soon. Thanks for watching. Bye.